Okay, let's take a look at some shoes. I think you guys are gonna be excited about these. I'm kind of excited. I, I got these yesterday, and I've been itching. And if you guys want to see more unboxings like this, make sure you guys do hit that like button and subscribe. Once I saw the price for these, I just jumped on them. I just jumped on them. I didn't want to wait on these. So we have a Nike Dunk box. These are going to sell out. These are going to be a huge problem. Let's take a look at it. Wow, dude, the material. So these are the Nike Dunk Low Fossils for $110. They're not going for a lot of money right now in the secondary markets. I already know like the Dunk hype, the Dunk craze is so insane right now. I know these are gonna be difficult. These are gonna be difficult to caught tomorrow. So I was like, you know what? You just saw my sneakers app account. I can't even hit the Jordan 1 utilities. So what makes me think I'm gonna hit these? I'm hoping maybe, you know, I grab them now and then the price might go up, you know, after everyone takes L's. So I might've gotten a pretty good deal. But the materials are super, super nice. Thought it would have been a little bit too kind of, I don't know, too soft of a tone, but I think I could pull these off. It's like a baby blue with like a little bit of a gray. It's like a nice light, light gray on the inside, on like on the side here and on the back. And then you have that nice kind of like light faded brown. I want to say like a nice light faded brown really really crispy and then like the material is better on these than they are on a regular dunk they're just way better like not like pandas pandas that thing was like stiff crease like the regular leather dunk this isn't leather a lot of people are comparing these to the curries those are one of my biggest regrets of not getting those were pretty difficult to get but they weren't going for a lot at the time um you also have like the the nice tone on the inside so i just jumped on them so someone's saying in the chat when PRM is on the box, it means high quality, amazing looking shoe. Really? Okay. Let me know what you guys think on these. Right now, what are they doing on the secondary market? They're going for, on average, 200 bucks. 180, 190. It means premium? It means premium, Ross. Wake up. Quality control, though, worries me on these, man. My quality control is okay, but there is some iffy spots on here. Like there's some glue stains here on the top. So the quality control is gonna be pretty rough on these. So be on the lookout. Just because with these materials, there's like little, little margin of error. Let me know what you guys think of the fossil rose dunk. If these are gonna be a cop or a drop, let me know in the chat, guys. Cop or drop. Any extra laces? No, no extra laces. You get what you get. You get what you get. You could switch it out. You could switch the laces out. Maybe go white laces. That would look clean. Wow, a lot of cops. Look at that. A lot of cops. I like them. I think these are clean. I think these are clean. Had to get them. Had to get them. Look at the back, too. The back is so crispy. What made me want these, because I stated on my streams that I was not feeling these. From the pictures, I thought they looked too soft, too monotone. I saw them at Got Soul, and one of the dudes from Common Hype was rocking these, and I was like, damn, they look clean on feet. I feel like with sneakers, it's always... I'm, listen, I'm no different than you guys. I hate on shoes and then I, I change my mind. It's it's a very common thing in sneakers. Sometimes these images come out, they look horrible. I don't can't really picture it, how it looks, how it's put together, how it's gonna look on feet. Uh, but that's it, man. So we that's the unboxing.